What's up? Welcome to my catch and cook video. Now, before I get started, I just want to let you guys know I did not catch this fish, but it was a team effort, so I got a slab of meat and uh, super excited to actually try this because it's fresh still. I just got back maybe about 20 minutes from the pier, so um, we're going to roll the clip and show you guys exactly what happened, and then we're going to go ahead and get started cooking up this meat. So. him up. team effort so I got to keep a slab of meat and um, and this is what it looks like look at that 
That looks pretty good, if you ask me. I can bite into it. But um, we're going to wash this first. And then uh, I'm going to cut it into like a piece of steak. And then we're going to slap it on a piece of foil paper with some seasoning. Yada, yada, yada. But um, yeah, let's wash this first. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is whew. so we gotta pat the fish down, make sure there's no water left over. Okay. Nice and dry. Okay, Ooh, look at that. Okay. Cool. So now, I'm not gonna cook this whole piece, so I'm gonna cut a piece off. And then, um, I'm gonna probably do it from here, so. Let's do this. Okay. Maybe about an inch, give or take. So let's cut into this. That's super, super tough, but look at how translucent it is. It's crazy. So that's the steak we're gonna gonna be cooking up right now. And uh, this is going back. We're gonna freeze this. And um, yeah. So, got some olive oil, some pepper, and some salt in here. So, uh, we're gonna get this pan going. We're gonna get it pretty hot. But drizzle some oil. Actually, let me turn that on so you guys can see. Drizzle some oil here. Some oil here. Like that. Make sure you get in there. oil both sides make sure you guys season both sides as always anything you guys do excuse the fireworks people don't understand that fourth of july is not all year long but um anyways so we got some salt here all right a little more i'm not gonna eat the skin so I'm not too worried about seasoning that and then some pepper. Wow, let me rinse my hand. Okay, so some pepper. That is still oily. Some pepper. Hoping that's hot enough, so I'm gonna go ahead and lay that in there, just like so. Whoa, interesting. Yeah, so like I said, don't forget to season both sides. Um, some olive oil already, so we're gonna put some salt here. Okay. That's good. 
and then of course the pepper So we're gonna do that. I've never even cooked this before, so I don't I don't really know how much time. But I'm just gonna go ahead and guess. A couple minutes maybe, and then go ahead and flip. So we're gonna close this up here. And then uh Okay, so we're gonna wait for a couple minutes and we're gonna go ahead and take a look, see what happens. All right, so it's been a few minutes. Um, yeah, about three minutes and we're gonna go ahead and take a look, see how well it's cooking. And I actually turned the heat down a little bit because I don't want it to burn. But um, yeah, let's take a look here. Whoa, that looks good. Let's go ahead and flip it. That looks flaky. Yeah, so we're gonna do another three minutes on that side and um, we'll go ahead and check in. I just wanna like, you know, already pick at it, but I'm gonna be a little patient here. Gonna close it right back up. Another few minutes. And um, I'm just gonna go ahead and dig in, you know? <laughs> I don't really care, so. Yeah, we'll, we'll check in in a little bit. All right guys, so I opened it up and it looks kind of ready, um, to be honest, except this little part. If you can zoom in right here, you see this area right here, this part. I'm gonna cut that off because see how this is raised and it's not really letting it cook fully. So I'm gonna chop that off and then I'm gonna take this off and I'm gonna try it out already, okay? So, take a knife. And we're gonna cut that piece off that I'm talking about. That little piece there. Cool. Now that that's off. Totally. So see how that side is cooked? But this side is not ready yet. So the rest of it looks just about ready to go so I'm gonna go ahead and plate it really quick so I'm gonna leave that cooking and I'm gonna take this piece off here oh I think it's just falling apart. I think it's ready. We're gonna go ahead and dig into this. It looks ready to me, to be honest. So let's go ahead and uh, get ourselves a fork here. And I'll be right back. I need some some sides real quick. Need a line. <laughs> so let's go ahead and cut this up. Bada boom, bada bang. So first taste test, actually, can't forget about this dude right here. Okay, so I'm gonna try it with no lemon or no lime or no chile, and we're gonna see how good it tastes, okay? So I'm gonna get this piece here. Look at that, looks. Oh, it's actually pretty good. That's not too bad, but we're gonna try some lime here. Okay. 
going to add some tapatio. Okay. Now let's try it with that. That's pretty good. Um, it's a little tough, but it's still pretty good. Like I would eat that like all day, every day. The lime and the chile cherry on top. Well guys, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and eat this up, but uh, that's gonna do it for this video. Thanks for watching, I appreciate you guys. Um, uh, make sure you like and subscribe and uh, yeah more content coming from me like I said in my previous video and um, yeah thank you guys see you guys next time